Hi everyone, welcome back to Interview Chronicles Season 5. Today we have Santosh here with us, who has been recently placed at Phone Pay as a part of his campus placements at PIT. He is here to share his interview experience with us. So, without any more further ado, let's go and talk to him and understand his experience. Hi Santosh, firstly welcome to my channel and congratulations on your placement. Thank you. Yeah, would you like to introduce yourself first? So, my name is Santosh Reddy. I'm currently pursuing my fourth year of B.Tech in Computer Science and Engineering in Velour Institute of Technology. My current CGPA is 9.38. Like My skills are web development, uh, machine learning and competitive programming. I have given like uh, completed my internship in a Unified Mentor Private Limited as a data scientist. And uh, I have solved 500 plus lead code problems to improve my DSA skills. Okay, okay, that's great. Thank you so much. Uh, you cannot tell us about the overall placement process, like how many rounds were there and what they comprised of. So, like uh, first, like they have given a shortlist of like seven to eight hundred members, uh, like um, selecting the nine pointers and the good resume candidates. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. after that, there was an online assessment round, uh, like after, just after the PPT, and okay. the online assessment round has like uh, four questions. It was like tough questions. Okay. Like. Uh, uh, the four tough questions like mostly based on dp and graphs okay. like i have solved two of them and uh at the later in the evening we got the results like uh, out of 700 like uh, 30 people got selected okay uh, on the next day like uh, we have like our placements of three rounds on the next day uh, in the velour campus okay. so we have to travel early in the morning mm -hmm. like uh, we went there like uh, around 8 pm that uh, that they were scheduled but it became some late and uh, it, it started at 9 p.m okay 9 a.m 9 a.m mm -hmm. like from 9 a.m like of the first round they uh, they had asked about uh, dsa two questions okay two tough uh, to medium level uh, lead code questions mm -hmm. like uh, they gave me like one one hour time i've solved the two questions in like uh, 50 to 55 minutes Okay. And then, like, uh, they said that, like, uh, they'll select me for the next round. Like, uh, okay. they just uh, gave a hint. Like, the mm -hmm. two questions were just uh, based, one was based on complete graphs, graph based. And one was, like, a uh, tree based, like, uh, a complete tree based, a generic tree, not a binary tree. Okay. The next, uh, like, uh, afternoon, like, uh, around 2 p.m., I got to know that I was selected for the second round. Like, uh, at 3 p.m., the, my second round has been started. And like for second round, like uh, out of the 30 people, 50 got eliminated and only okay. only 15 were left hmm. out of 15 people like uh, second round uh, attended the second round. The second round, they again gave me two DSA questions okay. like uh, they comprise like uh, they have uh, topics like D, uh, D dynamic programming and graphs. I have solved like I took a bit long for these two questions like they were very tough to okay. solve. Like, so they gave me small hints, like I uh, completed in uh, fifth, uh, one or 20 minutes, like, mm -hmm. like then they said, like, uh, you will have been uh, one more HR round at the last. Okay. Like, uh, when I came out and just uh, sitting for a while, like uh, they called me for the HR round. So for the HR round, they qualified like uh, eight people out of 15. Okay. So in the HR round, like uh, it was not like uh, completely HR round, it was HR plus technical. Like okay. uh, at the start, he, he started asking about my resume, like what are your projects, what the mm. internship, what's your experience, like that. And he mm. selected one of my project and uh, asked me to explain in detail, like uh, draw the system design for the entire project. Okay. Completely. Mm. And at the end, like uh, he asked like some general questions, like why did you select phone pay? Like uh, what will you do in the mm. first two months of your internship? What will you learn from this? Mm. Mm. Like finally, he said like uh, any more questions, like. Uh, to us like uh, and he ended that uh, like you can okay okay that's it like, okay so that's it so you had a total of three rounds three interview rounds right yes and first two were primarily based on dsa and the third yes. one was system design and on your projects and things yes like yes that. okay okay that's great thank you so much for sharing your experience finally how many people were selected like finally seven people were selected from all campuses together. Yes, right? yeah, from from all. Oh. Like from VAT Chennai, three were selected. Okay, okay, that's great. Yeah. Thank you so much for sharing your experience. 
and do you have any suggestions for people who are trying to get super dream jobs or anything that you want to yeah, share super, from that super dream like uh, you need to more focus on like uh, just the dsa like forget about the projects it, it will be the secondary part like right. dsa will get you to the round 2 like uh, right. the projects will decide only on the round 3 so to mm-hmm. get until the round 2 you just need to focus on your dsa like right. uh, it doesn't depend like how many questions you solve uh, how many uh, like uh, days you spend but it's like right. uh, when you feel comfort uh, comfort with the dsa you can stop mm-hmm. there right right that's it like okay got it thank you so much thank you for your experience and for the suggestions i'm sure it's going to help many people and okay. congratulations again yes thank you okay